just lost my briefcase. I don't know, but I'm asking you a question. Has anyone seen my briefcase? Like, you see, I'm going to a party. I don't really need the briefcase. But uh, I'm keeping it with me in case the party gets boring. Then I can go through some of my examination papers. You know? But, uh, can, can, well, I'm, I'm glad you're laughing because can I just say something to you? I must say, I must, I'm, I'm really enjoying you here this evening. You know, because uh, uh, the, all of you West Indians gathered here together. But no, it's, it's nice to see that you are behaving yourself <laughs> instead of causing trouble and being a nuisance to the authorities. <laughs> but, but one thing I've noticed, I've been, I've, been, I've been driving a lot at the moment, and I've noticed that a lot of you young West Indians, <laughs> Is driving. You're driving along like this. <laughs> what the hell are you doing? Lying down in the car driving. <laughs> with, with just the knuckles above the, the dashboard. <laughs> Have you got eyes in your knuckles? <laughs> it's too rough. You can't drive a car that way. You must be crazy. <laughs> and the man is even wearing dark glasses. These are so crazy. <laughs> I'm telling you. I just, I just want to stop. I, I, I'm working in the cab office at the moment. You know? <laughs> I just want to stop it because, not because of the stupid drivers, but because of the English. They, they get so drunk and they come in the cab office, right? <laughs> and they get in the cab and they start singing a stupid song. You know the stupid song they sing? <laughs> here we go, here we go, here we go. <laughs> here we go, here we go, here we go. <laughs> just the three watch over and over and over. <laughs> I said, can you please stop your bloody noise, thank you. <laughs> Where the hell are you going? You're not going anywhere. <laughs> you should stop your bloody noise. What's the matter with you? You know, they're telling me, telling me, say, oh, I'm here on Sofrat. I said, what the hell are you talking about? <laughs> here on Sofrat, I'll tell you something. I've been to high college. <laughs> I'm a Nigerian. You can't talk to me that way. <laughs> I'm starting to be an accountant. Just shut your bloody mouth, can't you? <laughs> I tell you the only thing I want to do. I tell you something. The only thing I want to do, I just want to win the lottery. <laughs> That's all I'm asking. I just want to win the lottery. I, I don't want. I don't want to win ten million. <laughs> I don't want to win eight million. <laughs> I just want to win three point five million. <laughs> If I win 3.5 million, I just tell my, my wife and her family, I said, go to hell. <laughs> I said it. I said it. <laughs> but the one thing, can, can I just say something to you? The one thing I must say I, I'm enjoying is this lovely West Indian low lady sitting here. <laughs> I mean, because all of these uh, young ladies, they are so mad for train. <laughs> they are so mad for train. <laughs> they are making the mad water. <laughs> yes, you see, I can see you couldn't understand what I was talking about. <laughs> I shall, I shall tell you the reason for that. I tell, you, I tell you seriously, the reason for that. A lot of you were studious. You can't speak the Queen's language. <laughs> I'm telling you, I'm telling you that for nothing. A lot of you West Indians, you can't talk at all. I'm telling you. Uh, for example, my wife's sister, she's married to a West India. <laughs> and this man, he keeps on ringing up the house. Last Christmas, ringing up the house, he said, Excuse me, did anybody ask for me? <laughs> so, what the hell are you talking about? The word is ASK. Why you even put that H and the X in it? It's so stupid. Ha, I, said, I said, no, there's nobody. Ha, 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 ha. <laughs> anything here, thank you. <laughs> you see, that is so important. I'll tell you something for nothing. I'll tell you it for nothing. It's very important to learn the language. And when you express yourself, the language is what makes it uh, easier to seduce the woman. You can caress the woman with the language. I'm telling you, you, must, you, must, you know how to use the language to caress the woman. I'm telling you. Do you, know, do you know how to pay a compliment to a woman? You don't have to problem. Well, I will make you even better, I will tell you. <laughs> now, now look at this gorgeous young lady sitting here. Just take a look at her. <laughs> I'm telling you to look at her. What's the matter with you? Look at her. Take a look at her. Keep looking at her. Now, I want you to repeat after me. Look into her face. <laughs> repeat after me. Oh, my goodness gracious. <laughs> Be dreaming. I, must be dreaming. I can't believe that you are sitting here. I can't believe you're sitting here. Looking so gorgeous and delicious. I think I love you. I 
and take me to, we should get married straight away. Get married straight away. Thank you very much. Congratulations. <laughs> I, I tell you, thank you. But the way, if you want to win any, I'll tell, tell you this for nothing. If you want to win any woman, the best way you can do it, put on the Isaac head. Ah, ah, ah. <laughs> this man, Isaac head. Ah, ah, ah. <laughs> this man is the big dada. You put on Isaac head. I stand a cue <laughs> of loving you too much. Yes, I'm talking about. Yes, I'm trying to say something. Okay, remember. Oh, my goodness gracious, I can't believe it. You're so gorgeous and delicious. Thank you.